Hi, this is Aaron. This is Andy. And this is Lacey. And this is Let's Play Bioshock Infinite Burial at Sea Episode 1. Woo! So yeah, last Tuesday this uh, game, or this DLC came out, and we're finally getting around to playing it. Yeah, don't really need much more pomp and circumstance than that. Burial at Sea, Episode 1. This is Episode 1 of Episode 1. Yeah. Oh shit, I unlocked 19, 1999 mode. That's huh? not. <laughs> That's not 1999 mode. Medium, because we're pussies like that. Why is it called 1999 mode again? Um, it has to refer to System Shock, uh, Irrational's other like groundbreaking awesome game. I'm pretty sure it came out in 1999, and it was hard as balls. It's an odd reference. <laughs> You're an odd reference. Your mom's an odd reference. Your dad's an odd reference. Hey, no. <laughs> oh, dreaming. <coughs> Gotta love those drunken fever dreams. <laughs> Damn it, this shit again. We're closed. You don't look the sort who can afford to turn down legitimate work. <laughs> was that a doll version of Elizabeth's head on her d How his about desk? We start with a light. Moving. We actually get to use Incinerate's original purpose: lighting cigarettes. Yes. Well, you gotta name this. Elizabeth. You can call me Elizabeth. What can I do for you? There's a girl who needs to be found. Maybe you've seen her. This girl. This girl's dead. You know her. You'll see dozens of her type down by the docks or the slums in Apollo Square. Orphans. With Fontaine's charity shut. No place for them. But her you know. As I said, the girl's dead. Lost. Oh, Look, hi there. I don't know where you get... Lost you. isn't dead. Name your radar. I'll pay you for this work. You'd well, now. this one gratis, wouldn't you? I don't follow. Something tells me you will. Bitch, you better pay me my money. First, let's see if there's anything around the office. Oh, God, I live in a dump. <laughs> so hey, this is, it's money again instead of silver eagles. So this is uh, pre, pre-revolution, right? Or pre-Civil War? Yep, this is... This is Rapture... Before it's fall. Man, we're gonna dump. Yeah, for being the city of glory and geniuses under the sea, your living quarters are pretty shitty. Oh god, my eyes! Oh god, the subtlety. <laughs> Seems my instincts were correct. Where's Sally? I don't know. But I know someone who does. Follow me. And your boobs. I will obey your boo. Oh wait, it's still probably not right to look at her boobs. Am I still it's technically her dad? I don't know. Her is my business, but I know where to start looking. Damn, this place looks it tells nice. Tells me a man with your particular talents could be useful. People aren't running through the streets stabbing each other with needles. No Pe one's crawling on the <laughs> ceilings. People are laughing and I'm not horrified. No one's Ryan, singing about their father. Or Jesus. Anything you say, pal. If I was alone in this, I'd say, why just one city? Why not two, eh? Three. Why not make two cities? Okay, so it doesn't look like there's much lootable stuff, but we're in rapture and no one's trying to kill us. Then Einstein would have remained a patent clerk. It's our responsibility. Kills! Here, here. He's the turtles. I like turtles. Hmm. Such a shame. Edward thinks the way to my heart is philosophical transcendence. <laughs> 
Oh, shut <laughs> up, bitch. <laughs> I, what? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> the way of my heart is philosophical <laughs> transcendence. Oh, that's so modern of you. <laughs> oh, look, they're still cute. Um, what happened to these children? You oh, say, God. Where have you been? A cabin in Arcadia? Little sisters. Adam a factors. cabin in Arcadia. Grotesque. Four score and seven but years ago. Just, they looked in unison. That was creepy. That's fucked up. I guess we've never seen. Live little sisters or ones that weren't completely batshit and trying to. Come on, come on. We haven't got all day. Actual working vacuum tubes. Soon the whole world will run on tubes. Oh, look. Uh, big daddies. Actually doing what their do jobs. Like Welding shit? Suits. Oh, wait. What do you mean? Are they just some kind of machine? They gotta do something cool with their drill now. Hi. My people need me. <laughs> I must go. My people need me. But big daddies can fly now. That's existentially horrifying. Why couldn't they fly before? Because that downloadable content wasn't available. Plot hole. Well, it's not really a plot hole once you find out why. Ooh, can I go in here? Time I can go in here. What's in here? Touch everything. Do you have any idea how valuable my time is? Okay, fixing an elevator, that's boring. Benevolence isn't human nature. Everyone wants to cut the tallest flower up there. Do something exceptional. Those Hello, boobs. How pointy you are. And misshapen. <laughs> what is wrong with your tits? <laughs> I don't know, Andy. Why don't you ask her? Newspapers. Waterfall. Underwater. Kind of redundant. I, I'm fine right here in Rapture. I just... I, I just can't get over how cool this looks. I mean, it's not dilapidated or leaking or any of that shit. Garbage can! <laughs> oh, I can't take anything from it. <laughs> I don't know why, Elizabeth, but I have the sudden urge to knock over that garbage can and see what's inside. The wit? The hostage sees you, he'll toss you out on your ass again. Great. Now I'm gonna have to find out what he means by that. <laughs> Fantastic. Funny. Is that a what? black guy? You're not yes. knowing about the little sisters. How long have you been in Rapture? Let's just say I don't get out much. You've got Seven eyes minutes. and ears, don't you? If I wanted to share my life story, Mr. DeWitt, I would write my memoirs. If I learned anything about Rapture, I thought it was a place where people understood to mind their own business. Where are we headed? The man Ooh. we need to see is in the Garden oh, yeah. of the Muses. How do you know? My sources are my own, Mr. DeWitt. If you have better information as to the whereabouts of your girl, I suggest you avail yourself of it. Oh, snap. Whale noises! Oh. I'm still the one who has to punch the fucking buttons. Oh, a button punching. Where are you taking me? When's the last time you saw Sally? What? She was taken from you, wasn't she? How do you know this? Oh, she was taken. It's a down at Surprise. You were playing the tables and... She disappeared. And? Cop <laughs> friend of mine, Sullivan. Says they found her floating in the docks. You see the body? Look. Did you see the body? I see your body. Values children, uh. not childhood. There's a profit to be made and men who make it. Profit? I'm taking you to one of them. Uh. <laughs> Is that just staring at the inside of a toilet? <laughs> just get these spells sometimes. It'll pass. I was having a memory of this morning. Ah. Refreshment, sir. Go ahead. Madam? We're fine, thanks. <laughs> and that's why teleport was a plasmid. <laughs> Goddamn Houdinis. I just... 
That's the reason why Houdinis were made, so waiters can teleport to people and either A, light their cigarettes with fire, or B, put ice in their drinks. Everything starts so innocent. Italians. Wait, you can't take a crap without a papal what? I didn't quite catch that. I'm guessing papal mandate or something, considering he's talking about Italy. Yeah, Italians. They're Roman ah, Catholicism. Mr. Back again. And so soon. Apparently you're an alcoholic. I know I'm an alcoholic. What else is new? Eat cheese! <laughs> cheese! Cheese! Cheese for everyone! Lots of cheese! Gambling? Yeah, why not? Strippers. Gambling. Dildo. You ass. Best quit while you're ahead. Shut up, bitch. You don't know. She is me. right, though. <laughs> well, I did and lose I my And I have no idea where I'm gambling. supposed to go. So, magic arrow? Yes! We get the magic arrow. We still have the magic arrow! <laughs> Which means we can ignore the magic arrow. <laughs> of course! That way I can explore. I like exploring. Because I need... I'm guessing I'm going to want some money. She's drunk. signore! Fucking Italians! <laughs> um, that's clothing. Boring. Ryan understands something fundamental. Rapture Records. I vaguely remember killing some people in Rapture Records. There's a nice guitar in the window. I wonder. Oh, and a cello. Or is it a Oh no, this is a bass. No, hold on. Go back. It's got the violin frame. It doesn't have the whole... Oh, you're right. It's a very tall cello, though. I hope someone got fired for that blunder. That is a very tall cello. Welcome, welcome. Wait, <laughs> wait. Only wait. we would argue about whether it was a cello or not. Piano. Yay, they brought this back. Oh, just hitting random keys. You got a white? And now uh, one more place I want to check out. Which is up here. Tubes. Tubes everywhere. Artists struggle. Oh God. Oh God. It's brilliant. Is that Frank the Rabbit? Oh God, we're gonna meet Sander Cohen. I can guarantee fucking key it. Oh dear. Take your time. Take it all in. Are you Sander yeah, Cohen? It's quite a breakthrough. Oh, you're too ugly to be Sander Cohen. God damn, are you ugly? Huh? What's with the Beatles haircut? I was just thinking that, but I didn't want to say anything because it would be an insult to Beatles haircuts. Look at haircuts. that painting. Go back. Look at that painting. It's got the rabbit ears. But what the fuck is with the face? I, I'm just waiting for Sandra Cohen to appear and start making me do shit again. I am out of here. Atlas Ryan. Atlas Ryan. Da, 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 da. Oh, you smell a booze, don't you? Ouch. <laughs> I don't give a shit. <laughs> Look at all the shit. Let me count the ways. Mr. DeWitt. Oh, yep. Cohen. We'll find my source inside of that club. I just... I can't. <laughs> I cannot. I can't explain why, but I really can't go through this door. Sander Cohen. 
Which business do you represent, sir? Uh, business? Yes, Watch, that's which peaches business? Behind the door. DeWitt Investigations. Mr. Cohen does not truck with private detectives. Masks of invitation went to artists and craftsmen alone. I'm with the artist struggle. We're expected. No mask, no entry. Stuffed shirt. These invitation masks he spoke of, they must have gone out to local artisans. Well, I guess we'll have to persuade someone to loan us one. The business of Rapture is business. It says it's sponsored by the artist struggle, the Golden Rule, and Rapture Records. I guess those stores would be as good a place to start as any. Hey, those were the places I just went to. How great would it be if the guy behind the door was Peach Wilkins? What brought you to Rapture? Oh, a man. God. Really? You don't strike me as the romantic type. Wasn't that kind of man. Then what? There's a debt that needs repaying. I've known my share of Shylocks. You're no Shylock. Wasn't that kind of debt. Days. Oh. Uh, pardon Ooh. me. Ooh. Why not? It's not illegal or anything. Is it? Put on this kimono. <laughs> shiny. If it's shiny, I look. Or take. Oh my god, actual audio diaries. It's not a voxophone? Su Chang observe strangest of coincidences. On the other side of a window, man in strange hat experimenting on Su Chung's own creation. On plasmid. Man name of Fink. Outrage! Death of intellectual property! I... <sighs> but man name of Fink is no fool. Through addition of oxidizing agent, turns plasmid ingestible through stomach lining. Mr. Ryan very impressed with Su Chong's initiative. Theft of intellectual property. Two-way street. Fink! Like Jeremiah Fink? As in that bastard from Columbia Fink. What the hell? I just... I bet we're gonna see friggin' Andrew Ryan arguing with Zachary Comstock later. Over the merits of religion. <laughs> and Elizabeth's head is going to turn around and explode. <laughs> and that will be the end of episode one. <laughs> Invitations to Cohen shows are highly coveted. Nobody's gonna just hand us one. You think you can figure them. out a way to distract the store owner while I take a look around? You just yeah, find boobs. the mask. Leave the distractions to me. Yeah, boobs. Because boobs. Seriously, if her shirt was any tighter, it would explode. Are you coming? Here, go to Mr. Beetle's Good head. Day. Excuse me. Lady has some questions for you. Yes, of course. Interesting, isn't it? An original Sander Cohen. He calls Called it, it Miasma. I'm sorry, but I know precious little about art. <laughs> How does it make you feel? She's I being all adorable and shit. Fear of what foolishness <laughs> tumble out. I'll just get drunk back here. <laughs> but of course. Oh, you know, for an alcoholic, I have the alcohol tolerance of like a four-year-old. That was two whole bottles in a couple seconds. And? <laughs> Where's that goddamn mask? Do you see all that in that little picture? Must be somewhere else. Yes. Oh well, this is open. Can I can I look? Is there anything in here? The door's halfway open, jackass. So beautiful. What does it mean? My dear, that something shiny. More whiskey. Everything you're so knowledgeable. Why you have given me so much to think about. I I feel a trifle swoony. Would you mind if, if I return tomorrow for further education? I shall be here at your service. Until tomorrow. This looks... His art looks so much better while I'm drunk. <laughs> <laughs> I feel that's like every art. <laughs> All Stare artists. at the art. Appreciate the art. Hank. Nothing. Let's find another shop. Vomit on the art. <laughs> <laughs> the vomit. Becomes art. 
Now, where the hell are those other stores? Press the shoot green shit out of your feet to tell you where to go. I wonder if anyone... I know we've asked this in the last Let's Play, but I wonder if anyone else can see the green shit. <laughs> that guy's clearly going that way. <laughs> Thank you, Magical Air. Oh, here we go. It's temporary. Temporary. Just like Gulag. <laughs> temporary. Oh, he's a Russian. A fine day temporarily you. like Gulag. You see that dish I walked in with? Will you give her the star treatment, pal? And I'll make it worth your while. Of course, right away. I'm interested in this piece. Uh, the dish. I haven't you missed? It's She's a dish. Sapphire and diamond, eighteen carat gold ring, three hallmark for parents, eighteen. I better get some nice loot from back here. There better be more whiskey bottles. That's a lot of fine talk about a stolen ring. I beg your pardon. Right out of her coffin in Twilight Fields. Did you think we Kinda wouldn't notice? God damn, she's good. The assurances of a grave She took some lessons no from you. Of course. Considering I'm currently in the process of trying to rob them. I don't think so. Hit the bricks, you tramp. I'll see to it, baby. Banana! Get your hands off me! Nothing. Well, at least there's money. Place left. You're gonna have to go back and kick that guy's ass. Oh! How the? Did he? I'm guessing she kicked him right in the nads. Hmm. Yeah, you're not raw. Nothing. No. We've got one place left though. And if that she did that in the we'll cross that game, didn't she? Like one of the first battle sequences you get in, she kicked a dude right in the cock. Oh sure, when a woman does it, it's awesome, but when a guy does it, he's a wimp. Unless it's Rochambeau. Yes. <laughs> Look around, please. Hey pal. Put your you eyes. Wanna help down. out the little lady? Yes, of course. Okay, now I'm just waiting for the Lutises to show up and be like some of the shop owners. <laughs> or all of the shop owners. <laughs> At the same of course, time. Covered by Where is he hiding that box? Lovely. There you are, you little Lovely. son of a bitch. And a trumpet. <laughs> is this the music store? This is the music store. Who keeps nothing in a violin case? I'm just waiting to find like a Tommy gun or something. Just. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I could pluck the strings. Pizzicato. And now I can see where the safe is open because there's nothing in there. Why even have a safe? And why even have lootable boxes when there's nothing in them? False hope. I must go. I must go. <laughs> One more note shall prove my undoing. Oh god, I think she's faking an orgasm. I'm out of here. <laughs> I bet she does that a lot. And I know done. she does that a lot. <laughs> Good. You've located the mask. Third time's the charm. Alright, it's best we head back to Cohen's. Yeah, 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 back to Cohen's. Fine piece of work back with those shopkeeps. You've got a bit of the grifter in you. For that, you can thank my father. Oh, yeah? He uh. was a man comfortable in a variety of roles. Uh. What is she hinting at? Father. Lover. You know. I... I don't want to know. I'm good. Enter the club! Next episode. Okay, so first episode of the Burial at Sea DLC, and once again, fetch quests. Fetch quests. <sighs> Fantastic. I've missed the fetch quests. But yeah, so next episode, I can guarantee it, we're, her contact has got to be Cohen. It, 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 it cannot be anyone other than Cohen. We'll see. We'll see. 
So join us next time on Let's Play Bioshock Infinite Burial at Sea, episode one. We are going to have to think of a shorter title. See you next time.